What up, world, and YouTube fans? Uh, it's Ray2K back with another um, video, part three. Um, just want to discuss about this back plate here when when installing a CPU fan. It does have some type of double sided tape onto it. It's kind of rough taking it off, but uh, I got it off. Um, so so far, doing a little medicating here, and. Um, I'm going to um, go ahead and complete the installation on the fan here. So here's the motherboard, guys, for those who haven't had a chance to go in there. <coughs> I left my RAM in there. So uh, for those guys that wanted to know the RAM, uh, I guess you can't see that. huh? It is uh, crucial. 8 gigabyte 1GX64 DDR3 1333 UD UDIM 240. So for those guys who wanted to know what RAM I was using, there you go. Um, I have a total of two 8 gigabyte slot, um, two 8 gigabyte cards, so 16 total, 16 gigabytes. So we're just trying to beef it up a little. You know, for all the guys, you know, saying I'm wasting money and, you know, shit like that. Um, you could just keep your comments to yourself. I mean, I'm I'm really enjoying myself. Um, again, if I wanted to fucking make a build a rig, I could do that, honestly. Um, just want this shit to be real nice and tricked out. So uh I'm gonna go ahead and install these, uh the the fan the fan, the CPU fan. And by the way, I'm gonna do that the single fan so there you go and I'm gonna go ahead and do that then I'm gonna go ahead and uh, re reinstall windows on the SSD 128 gigabyte the OCZ version just to uh, have something to to um, boot off of then I'll install the second hybrid SSD 750 gigabyte and then I'll try to transfer this stuff I have a little thermal take black X uh, the USB thing where I can try to get some of the information off of here that I have on this hard drive and put it onto the other. Maybe save myself some download time for Battlefield and all those other games that I installed. So, um, stick with me, guys. Uh, it's Ray2K again. Thanks for looking. Like the comment, subscribe, uh, and, you know, watch me continue to just do as many upgrades as I can. Um, I've been hearing about some new graphics cards, um, and my son, you know, he uh, is pretty much not really wanting to play the Xbox anymore. He's trying to lean towards the the PC, and, you know, he's six years old, so I'd rather him play PC games than to fucking play on the console. So what I did was I took my uh, GTX 555, put it upstairs, and let him, you know, play around with that computer with the games and stuff, and he, he's enjoying it. And... uh. Basically, you know, I, I I was up there tinkering around with it, and and you know it was pretty good, but it, the graphics weren't where I wanted it to be. So um, I'm thinking about actually go ahead and and uh, putting the uh, the Sapphire 7870 OC upstairs into his computer, and um, possibly shopping for another graphics card. So. Um, I've heard NVIDIA got some new, you know, 60, 600 graphics cards and everything. I uh, saw the 680 drop and, uh, you know, looked at that and it wasn't really compatible with what I'm trying to do. And um, see that they're coming out with some new graphics cards by May 5th. So we'll see what they come out with if, if they have the new uh, 660 or 670 and the power consumption is, matches up with what, what we have and, you know, the diagram and you know the length and everything matches up we'll see what we can do but uh if if it does man count up for uh an a upgrade and um thanks a lot for you know watching my videos guys and uh you know people with the positive comments you know i really appreciate it um uh, and i hope i hope these videos help a lot of you guys out honestly cuz uh i only make them because when i do look no one's the information is not there so